Hey everyone, long time no see. Today I'm going to show you how to get this edgy black and gold holiday makeup look. The first thing I'm going to do is apply a piece of scotch tape to the outer corner of my eyes just so that my eyeshadow will be really nice and sharp. Then I'm just going to apply my Urban Decay Primer Potion in Eden all over my eyelids and also in the inner corner and underneath. Next I'm applying my NYX Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencil in Milk onto my inner corner, eyelid, and brow bone. Then I'm just going to go ahead and blend that out with my finger. Now moving on to eyeshadow, I'm going to take this gold color called Half Baked and pat that on my eyelid and also my inner corners. After that, I'm just going to apply this matte light brown color into my crease with a fluffy brush and it's called Naked and I'm just using this to make sure everything is all blended and to give a nice transition into the highlight color. Alright, now I'm going to take this pointy blendy brush and apply a dark brown color into my crease. And I want this to be sort of a cut crease look so I'm keeping that color right in the crease of my eye. And I don't know if you can tell but I switched over to a shorter denser brush for a little bit more precision. So now I'm taking a matte black color and I'm just going to apply that basically right where I applied the brown, but I'm focusing it more into the outer corner of my eye. And don't be shy to take that eyeshadow all the way out to the tape. When you take it off, it'll give you a nice clean cat eye look. Next, I'm just going to apply my highlight color with a flat shader brush right underneath my eyebrow and also a little bit in my inner corners. Time for the fun part! Now I'm just taking off the scotch tape and cleaning up with a makeup wipe. Now I'm just going to make sure everything looks blended and even and I'm going to come back with my eyebrows filled in. Yep, and I'm just intensifying that gold a little bit more. And now I'm intensifying the black a little more. Now I'm going to line my eyes with my Wet n Wild liquid eyeliner into a wing and also line my upper and lower water lines with a black eyeliner. Then I'm just going to smudge it out a little bit with some black eyeshadow and a pencil brush. And I also used a smaller brush to be more precise towards the inner corners. And then I just put some more gold in the inner corner. And now I'm applying my mascara to both the bottom and top eyelashes. And I just applied a natural set of eyelashes on top. And I'm just going to contour my face. I'm using my Hoola Bronzer by Benefit. And I just contoured my cheekbones and my nose. Now I'm taking a bigger, fluffier brush and I'm just blending it out. And I'm applying some more bronzer on my hairline and also my jawline and neck. After that, I'm just going to apply a peachy pink blush. It's called Melba and it's from MAC. And I'm just applying that on the apples of my cheeks and cheekbones. Also a little bit on my temples, nose, and chin. Then I'm just going to go ahead and apply a highlighter to my cheekbones, my nose, my cupid's bow, chin, and above my eyebrows. Moving on to lips, I'm just going to apply a little bit of concealer on my lips. Then I'm going to line them with this uh, nude pencil. And I'm going to apply a nude lipstick. This one is called Hue, and it's by MAC, and it's by far my favorite nude lipstick that I own. And that's the first lip option. It's my favorite one. But if you think you need a little bit more color, go ahead and apply a more natural looking lipstick. This is Rimmel's Lasting Finish Lipstick by Kate, and it's number 80. Or if you really want to get into that holiday spirit, wear a red lipstick. This is by Maybelline, and it's in the color Very Cherry. Well, that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Happy holidays, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!